YouTube was going on there. Everybody back here with another video and, uh, I'm not home. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm not home. So, uh, yeah, Mike might sound different. Everything might sound different, but work with me. Hey everyone. I'm okay. That's too loud. That's one thing that's for sure that that's too loud. Masha V, CEO of Steel City. Oh, and this is going to be the health and damage balance. Balancing. Welcome back to another undisputed development update. In our previous update, we shared our overall goal of gameplay balancing, which is to make it viable for players to fight in a variety of styles that are authentic to the sport and to the fighters in our roster, and how some of the stamina changes we've made to the game will enable us to do that. In this update, we're going to talk through some of the health and damage balancing and how the changes we're working on help achieve that overarching goal. Okay. Throughout early access, players told us and data showed that winning fights by KO was much more about progressive damage and clean combinations and less about perfectly timed counter shots. Yeah. Which has meant that some of those more devastating punches on the roster haven't felt as <laughs> They're not get that. <laughs> That's funny as shit. Devastating punches on the roster haven't. Oh, <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. To that end, <clears throat> we've increased the damage dealt by power punches, and we've also increased the damage dealt by a punch being a counter punch. So, if you're able to catch your opponent slacking and land a clean power punch, oh. the likes of the oh. Wilder. So I, I, I mm, let me not say. And land a clean power punch with. Four moving straight. Um, we can see it, it. It got sped up. So if you're able to um, catch your opponent slacking, not surprised by, it, but it looks like it. Like so, Deontay Wilder, catch your opponent slacking and land a clean. Power Damn, punch. boy, it looks like I'm not gonna lie. It looks like it can like connect from far away though. Deontay Wilder or Frank Bruno. I don't remember. No. Definitely feel it. You know, see. While we've increased counter punch damage, we've also <coughs> reduced the counter window, meaning your punches yep. have to be even more well. That counter window was huge, boy. Counter punch. So read your opponent and time your shots well if you want to maximize damage. Yeah, time. Make time in a thing. I like that. It's not all about the big hitters, though. Like we said, we want to ensure that choosing high output fight styles and fighters like Joe Cole. Yeah, Brady, that the 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 straight coming forward is like. Fighters like Joe Damn Cole. boy, he got a, some reach on him. To compete in undisputed, we've introduced direct. Oh, hold on, two, uh, four moving. Viable ways to compete in undisputed. I'm trying to like, yeah, four moving jab to the body. Look at this. Or viable ways to compete in undisputed. Let me slow it down. Hold on, I'm sorry, I don't want to make this video too long. <laughs> I don't want to make this video too long. Uh, where's the speed? I gotta show it though. I gotta show it. Look, mmm, I like that. We've introduced directional damage, which means that forward moving punches now do more damage. Directional damage? damage Hold on. Or viable ways to compete in undisputed. We've introduced directional damage, which means that forward moving punches now do more damage than backwards moving yeah, punches. That, yeah, that, that forward moving straight is going to be a problem. More damage. Because, like, he's from. I mean, it, it, it's kind of like a. It's not even. It's almost like a lunge, ain't it? That's a. That's That's pretty far. And backwards we'll see though well, i'll have to actually play with it in game i don't know if i have i'll see fighters that can i want to see what it it just looks like from on the front foot. far away i don't want to speak on it and say for sure cons, um whether or not damage. let me I'm, I'm not even listening like joe calzaghi <coughs> ways to compete in undisputed we've introduced directional damage which means that forward moving punches now do more damage than backwards moving punches oh yeah w this hope for the big hitters, but it's also great for pressure fighters yeah. that can build up that long-term damage by fighting on the front foot. And we feel this balances out the pros and cons of both fighters. No, it doesn't. Foot and your back foot. No, it doesn't. Uh, because you have a front, you have a loose footwork mechanic that, I mean, it's it's ridiculous. <laughs> it's ridiculous how good it is. Um, and it just it's really a speed buff and a damage buff. So. Hopefully that is taken into account as far as the backwards moving damage nerf. Hopefully that is get, gets taken into account, not just punching going backwards. Hopefully, um, then punching moving forward. It's been it's needed a nerf. We have already seen the forward moving straight, which well I'll have to 
test and look at myself. And then the forward moving body jab, which looks really, it looks really good. So. Additionally, we've increased the speed of health regeneration for short term head and body health. Okay. While increasing the damage dealt to maximum head and body health. Oh. The goal here is to ensure that players and AI can have those high body body health while increasing the damage dealt to maximum head and body health. Okay. The goal here is to ensure that players and AI can have those high pace, high action rounds. Yeah. Without them leading to an excessive number of knockdowns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll also ensure that doing so repeatedly and successfully throughout a fight will take its toll in the long run. I did. I just hope we don't get go back to rock 'em sock 'em. We'll we'll have to see. Stuff like that really needs to get like checked and make sure it's balanced cuz we don't want to go back to rock 'em sock 'em. All in all, all in all, I enjoyed it. I don't want to make this video too long, man, but uh yeah, that was a that was some good updates. Just some stuff I would need to get my hands on and and test and see for myself before I say I like or dislike it. But yeah, I'm out. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace. Let me know you what your thoughts in the comments. Bye.